What kind of stuff do I need to be doing this at home? Let's get to it. Welcome to the channel, guys. Welcome to the Hair Experience. I am Curtis, your guide to get luxurious, popping, banging, beautiful hair back on your head. Hit those buttons for me. Boom, boom, hit it. HairbyMHE.com. Use that coupon code MHE20 to save $30 on your hair replacement unit. HairbyMHE.com. That's what pays the bills, folks. I've got to feed the family, you know? Anyways, get to it. All right. What, what tools do I need to do this? It's not a lot. And most of it you probably already have at home anyways. Um, so you're new to this, right? And you just got going. You're like, oh my God, I know, what am I going to do? What, what, do I need? what do I have to have? Really basic stuff, okay? We're going to start with the products. Shampoo, conditioner, leave-in conditioner. You really want to get something made for this industry, made for hair replacements. Um, Professional Hair Lab sells a great product. We sell a great product, and this is not churching up our stuff, telling you you have to have it. It's just smart to have the tools for the job. The reason that I say this is because I know Professional Hair Labs and myself, we control what goes inside of our shampoo, conditioner, and leave-in conditioner. So if you buy something off of a shelf, wherever you get it from, it can be ultra high-end stuff, great stuff. But they can change the products inside that product, unbeknownst to you, you're using it and you could cause failure on a unit. We control what goes in our products so we know whatever is in there is not gonna cause a hair unit to fail or give it any problems at all. Um, that's one thing. Um, so you've got that shampoo, conditioner, and leave-in conditioner. I use my leave-in daily. I shampoo once every four days, depending on my activity level. Condition a little bit, like dime size daily. Just put a little bit in my hands, run it through my, hand, run it through my hair in the shower. Um, you're gonna need adhesives, tapes, um, something to do touch-ups at home. Uh, you can go to our supply section on the website, check those out, you can buy them from anywhere. Whatever is your flavor that you want to do, make sure you've got something at home to be able to do touch-ups. A little bit of bond on the front edge, something like that. Um, that's really what you need for that. Isopropyl alcohol, 91% or better. Um, and an adhesive remover to get rid of tape, adhesive, bond, or all the above. Um, that way you can do it properly and not destroy your unit trying to clean it. Um, next, the hard, the hard tools. Um, tweezers, just a simple old pair of tweezers you probably have at home that's gonna be for plucking at the hairline, that's gonna be for getting a little piece of material off of the hairline, um, anything like that. Eyebrow scissors. I never heard of a pair of eyebrow scissors in my life before I did this. So these are, these are, let me see if you can see that. These have a curve to them. They don't necessarily have to be curved like this. They can be flat as well. This is for trimming up the hairline. If you've got some excess material sitting there um, that you need to get rid of. I like these. Um, I like that fat, chunky hairstyle, you know, like if that makes any sense, like groups of hair together. So this, you'll see how nasty and dirty this is. This is mine, personal one out of my drawer. So it's a wide tooth comb. You can buy these at Walmart. This is a Con Air product. There's nothing um, great about it. Just plastic, make sure it's got plastic fat tips on it. And a cushion hairbrush. This is my nasty one out of my drawer that I've been using since day one. Um, you want it to have the little knurls on the top of it, the little nylon knurls on the top of it. You don't want it to catch on your unit. So a good cushion brush, well, this one's got water in it because I used it in the shower this morning, as you can tell, my stuff. Used it washing my hair this morning. So that's that's really all there is to, to having products for this job. That's all the products that you need. So, I mean, that's it. Check out my TikTok, Hair by MHE. I'm going on TikTok. I'm super excited about it, to be honest with you. Um, subscribe to the TikTok. I'll put a link down in the description. So thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Have a great day, and thank you for the business. We are always grateful. Thanks.